Sweet potatoes are one of the most cultivated staple root crops that are grown in many parts of the world. The origin and domestication of sweet potatoes occurred in either Central or South America at least 5,000 years ago. Sweet potatoes are known for their sweet taste, delicious and nutritious tubers that come in a variety of colors, including orange, yellow, and purple. The life cycle of sweet potatoes can be divided into several distinct growth stages, sprout development, transplanting, vegetative growth, tuber initiation, tuber development, and tuber maturation. Sweet potatoes are usually planted in the spring or early summer. Their first stage is sprout development. The sweet potatoes or their cuttings as seed are planted in the soil, and the seed starts to germinate. During this stage, the sweet potato seed produces sprouts, which are small green shoots that emerges from the soil. The sprout is usually about 2 to 3 cm tall, and it will continue to grow taller and form sweet potato vines. The vines are typically grown in a warm and humid environment to encourage sprouting. Sweet potato slips are young plants that are grown from the cuttings of vines. This stage typically lasts for several weeks. Once the sweet potato slips are developed to 6 to 8 inches, they can be transplanted into the field. The transplanting of slips marks the beginning of the vegetative growth of sweet potatoes. This stage typically lasts for about 2 to 3 weeks. The slips are usually planted in rows about 12 to 18 inches apart and 6 to 8 inches deep in the soil. During this stage, it is important to provide adequate water and nutrients to the newly planted slips to help them establish roots and begin growing. The vegetative growth stage is characterized by the rapid growth and development of the sweet potato vines. This stage involves the development of new leaves, stems, and roots. The leaves are large and heart-shaped with bright green color and slightly fuzzy texture which help the plant to photosynthesize and grow. The stems are thin and wiry with leaves spaced evenly along the stem to provide structural support for the plant. The roots are complex, long and slender with small root hairs to help absorb water and nutrients from the soil. The sweet potato vines can grow up to several feet long and produce numerous branches and leaves. Pruning and trellising can be used to manage the growth of the sweet potato vines and promote better air circulation and sunlight exposure. This stage typically lasts for about two to three months. The tuber initiation stage marks the transition from vegetative growth to the development of sweet potato tubers. During this stage, the sweet potato plants begin to produce small storage roots that will eventually develop into mature sweet potato tubers. This stage typically occurs about three to four months after planting and is triggered by environmental factors such as changes in day length and temperature. The tuber development stage is characterized by the rapid growth and development of the sweet potato tubers. The sweet potato plant is focusing its energy on producing and growing the tubers, and accumulating starch and other nutrients in the tubers. The size and quality of the tubers are influenced by the availability of water, nutrients, and sunlight. This stage typically lasts for about two to three months. During this stage, the sweet potato plant also produces small, inconspicuous flowers. The flowers are typically white or pink, and tubular in shape. The flowers do not have a significant impact on the development of the sweet potato crop, and the plant is still focusing on growing and developing its tubers during flowering. However, the flower seeds can be used to grow new sweet potato plants. On average, the flowering stage lasts for about two to three weeks. The tuber maturation stage marks the final stage in the life growth of sweet potatoes. The sweet potato plant continues to grow and produce tubers until reaching maturity. During this stage, the leaves of the plant begin to turn yellow, the sweet potato vines begin to wither or die back, and the tubers reach their maximum size, quality and sweetness, which indicate that it is time to harvest the crops. This stage typically lasts for about one to two months. 
It is important to carefully monitor the sweet potato plants during this stage to determine when the tubers are ready for harvest. Harvesting sweet potato typically takes place in the fall. The mature sweet potato tubers are carefully dug up from the soil manually or with the use of mechanical equipment. After harvesting, the sweet potatoes are usually cured in a warm and humid environment for several days to allow the skin to thicken and the starches to convert to sugars. Cured sweet potatoes can be stored for several months in a cool and dry location. In conclusion, the duration of each life growth stage is dependent on several factors, including the variety of sweet potato, the environmental conditions, and the cultivation practices. On average, it takes about 90 to 170 days for sweet potatoes to mature from planting. Understanding the life growth stages of sweet potato plants is important for successful sweet potato cultivation and maximizing yield and quality. It is worth mentioning that sweet potato plant does not tolerate frost. About 100 million tons of sweet potatoes are produced worldwide each year. China produces more than 50% of the world total, and is the largest sweet potato producer in the world. Secondary producers are Uganda, Nigeria, and Tanzania. According to a study by the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization, sweet potatoes are the most efficient staple food to grow in terms of farmland, yielding approximately 28,000 kilocalories per acre per day. Sweet potatoes are a staple food, and can be used in a variety of dishes. Here are some popular sweet potato-based foods. Sweet potato fries are a popular side dish and snack. Sweet potato pie is a dessert made with a filling of mashed sweet potatoes. Sweet potato casserole is a side dish made with mashed sweet potatoes. Roasted sweet potato is a tender and crispy side dish. Sweet potato gnocchi as small dumplings made with sweet potato puree. Sweet potato biscuits are savory biscuits made with sweet potato puree. Sweet potato pancake is a side dish made with mashed sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes are also used in many industrial applications, including the production of starch, alcohol, and animal feed. Sweet potatoes are good sources of complex carbohydrates, dietary fiber, and many essential vitamins, including vitamins A, B and C, minerals, including potassium, and magnesium, and antioxidants such as beta-carotene. Sweet potatoes also contain a significant amount of proteins, and are low in fat. Sweet potatoes are naturally gluten-free, making it a good choice for people who have celiac disease or gluten intolerance.